EA Sports and the PGA Tour proudly present the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. From Ponte Vedra Beach, Florida and TPC Sawgrass, live opening round coverage of the Sawgrass Invitational. We've got a full field ready to get rolling on this Thursday as we get a look at the early leaderboard. Your leader is Wake Forest's Will Zalatoris. He's come into this one on fire at 10 under par. Meanwhile, our featured golfer in good form coming into this one fresh off a of victory a week ago. Okay, that's a good one to start safely in the fairway to get the tournament underway. Put himself in an excellent position. Keyboards, 88 yards. Really good opportunity here. Second shot. Ah, good shot. Safely on the green and a birdie chance. Nota Begay the third is down there. This for an opening birdie. And players have a option to take less break by increasing the speed here. Oh, yes. Plenty of pace to get up that slope. It is in for a birdie. And he's very quickly to one under par. This one turning left a bit off the tee. Well, that one misses the fairway, but Frank, not too bad. So a chance still to get out of the gates, birdie, birdie. Yeah, golf's not a game of perfect. I'm curious on how this second shot's going to be hit, though. Safely back into the fairway. That was the job at hand, and it's a good end result. This a little under 10 feet for birdie. Yes, can't ask for a better start to a round than this. It is back-to-back -back birdies at one and two. Ball's going to wind up into that boomerang shaped bunker in the back left area surrounding this third green. Uh, that one kind of took off on him. That'll happen sometimes coming out of the bunker, and that scoots right on by. Yeah, no mistaking that one. That is a good par here at the third. And he'll stay at two under.
Ah, so tempting to go for it right, but that's a very smart layup. Going to leave a simple little wedge shot into this fourth green. Frank, the approach here to the fourth is fraught with peril, isn't it? Three distinct levels here. There's that sort of small piece in the front right. There's that left side of the green and that top tier on the right. That's a good shot, and more importantly, too, a green in regulation, so birdie chance. Oh, no problems at all. The pace perfect. It is in for birdie. Well, that one's finished in the first cut. It's going to be a little bit harder to spin it from there with a little bit of grass around the ball, but uh, still not too bad. Oh, that's not too bad. Good shot. Inside 20 feet, I would imagine. So a good chance, really outside chance for Betty. Yeah, that's good pot. A birdie here at one. Yeah, nothing a fault there. Good balance, good follow through, and a good start to this hole. From the fairway, Noda, this is second. 112 to the hole. Swinging it great today. Would not surprise me if he stuck it close. With all the elements of his game have been in sync today, a terrific shot right there. It's all about getting it inside that three-foot circle around the hole. That was a really nice shot. They call that position A. That's going to be right down the middle. Should be able to spin this if he wants. 96 yards left for his second. This one has a chance to be close. Oh, he's coming out of the gates today beautifully, and there is another chance. He's been automatic on this front side. This for birdie. Ah, yes, runs that one right in. It's a birdie here at the seven.
Solid shot and sometimes solid throughout the round will win the day. This one, not for the faint of heart. Down a big slope, though it is for birdie. Will that stop? Yes, that was not easy down the slope, but that's pretty well done. Okay, that in for par here at the eighth. And he'll stay at five under. He just keeps motoring right along. Another good tee shot right there. Two shots around this green is always good. Now, for a little CVS, perhaps a third shot on this par five, get one close, maybe make four. Now this for another birdie. Yep, that's nicely done. It's a birdie here at the ninth. And that will make this an even 30 for the front side going out in six under par. Second shot now, it has to be careful because that breeze can be tricky at his back. You don't want to overclub. And safely on deck. That's the main thing, but from that distance, really don't want to leave yourself like a knee knocker, like a four or five footer. So this first putt's going to have to be good. Mm, good effort, but that'll run two, three feet past the hole. So that's in for par to start this back side. And he'll remain at six under par. Boy, a good round going here on this Thursday, and that another fine effort off the tee.
That second shot got all the way down by the green, but in the bunker. So we'll have to see what the explosion shot can do from here. Really need a birdie right now. Oh, off the flagstick. Chance now for another birdie. Nope. So that brushed in for a par here at 11. And he'll remain right where he is. so simple when you're going good, doesn't it? And that is yet another solid drive. Gotta think this an extra half club or more as he sets for a second into the wind. Do it. It's a birdie here at 12. And he's going to move to seven under. Three shots back. That one, safely on the putting surface. This would be a big bonus if it went in more than likely just trying to get this one close. in for par here at 13. And he'll stay at seven under. This starting up the right side. Frank challenging approach shot here at the 14th. Yeah, there's some subtle mounds in this green. Uh, one that comes in on the right, and then another one that starts to come in about two-thirds of the way down on that left side. Well, I own has had a good look. Now this for birdie. Well, for a long putt like this, there's really not a whole lot to it. I think you'll fancy his chances at this one. Yep, not bad. Had to put a little extra into that one, but got it there. That's a pretty good effort. No issues there. It is a par here at 14. And he'll stay right where he is. Really starting to make a hard game look easy. Drive after drive has been superb. And this one, well, as we like to say, is in the mayor's office. Now note of his second from the fairway. Looking at 153 to the hole. Pin about medium depth, though it is on the left side.
Well, not super close, but uh, safely on the green. Here we go. This one for birdie. Oh, yes. Plenty of pace to get up that slope. It is in for a birdie. And he's going to move to within two of the lead now at eight under par. No issues here. That is into the fairway. Got every bit of that through it all the way there and got it to stop. Home in two on the par five. Mm, the speed was right what you want, but the eagle putt doesn't go down. That's good putt. A birdie here at one. And he'll get this to within a shot of the lead as he moves to nine under par. Okay, mission accomplished. That is safely aboard this island green. Oh, how about the run here? That a third consecutive birdie. Everything flowing really well right now. Coming off three birdies in a row. Here's another solid tee shot as well. Breeze at his back shoulder as he lines up his second from the fairway. Uh, good shot. Safely on the green and a birdie chance. Now this for another birdie. Oh, yeah. Birdies on 15, 16, 17, and 18. A final look at the leaderboard shows our featured golfer on top by a shot. So some good playing here in round number one, Frank. It certainly is, uh, Rich, but there's a long way to go. It's just a sliver of a lead. So that's it for us. For Frank, Noda, Iona, and our entire crew, Rich Lerner saying thanks for joining us. We'll see you next time on EA Sports PGA Tour.